Hello, welcome to the tutorial. And here I will gonna talk about the make code method and make class method in a T tree class here. But basically it's not really highly uh, recommended uh, because that um, these two methods can help us to get some very basic structure such as how to link the variable to uh, the tree that's generated by these two methods automatically. So uh, the way is that the code generates some the, this method generates some code for you, but actually if the structure is really complicated, um, sometimes it's not so appropriate because when you want to do a, a more sophisticated analysis, that is what not so uh, easy to just use in this uh, uh, method here. But anyway, we ju we can take a look of it, and it will be a very very short tutorial here. So in this tutorial, the outline is we have two steps here. First is create a very simple root file, and you might see it before is example one that root uh, this file here, and inside it has a tree. And the second step is to just uh, directly use a met code method or met class method here. So let's start it. So I use this slide to just uh, load in the demo one that seed and there is a function example one and it will create the file there. So if it's not created, it was now created. Now there is a file there. So I use the T file as I always use this to load in the example one dot root then there is a tree called T here you see so I just uh, use this line to assign to my pointer sorry oh quick quickly all right. So this is the first step and it will finish. Now we see what happened here. So let's so we just take a look what happened. So this is a tree's name and a variable, three variable, very simple. And each variable uh it, it, sorry is three three branch and each branch just has one direct and leave there. So suppose that uh we use the make code make code what happened so here you can have some option to the output file name so if you don't put the output file name the default would just like a tree and that's C here so now I put in a output file name I call the code from example one that C here all right so it says that is obsoleted make class or make the letter instead here. Uh, you know, uh, make code actually is just very basic one. But remember, when you use the tcam object, you can only use the make code, not make class here. So let's take a look about how we just create. We our uh, our final result is this. So you can see is bunch of uh, code already output from the make code method here. Actually, it's quite simple. So uh, first, you can see there is a block tell you which version by the, the root you you use. Here I use 5.34, and okay, so this is just some command, so, so comment, so you don't need to read it. So the first thing here, uh, it gives you some uh, information that so uh, I reset all the settings. Like uh, uh, when you have some drawing set up or drawing setting, I reset all the thing here. This line tell you like this, and this tell you I declare a file pointer to point this guy, and I want to read this one here. All right. So then I read in, then I uh, get in a tree called t here, and I declare some the leaf variable 
like I have is the leave money A is integer and it will automatically make up there and then I have variable and I link to the branch here the branch name is MA and I link to my uh, variable A here this is just my the, the, the method it created here okay it worked pretty well for a very simple structure but if you have a class or a class have an object on another class and then this class have a structure actually it's not quite um, easy for the make code to work really appropriately alright so this command here tell you uh, if you don't want to link all the branch because sometimes there are too many branch and you just want a certain branch to be linked to your variable you can first use this one then uh, to open uh, or to set up the, the branch you want from here so basically it's not really uh, tell you not very really much things here so then he declare a long uh, very long type integer is the entries number here from the, t the get entries method here so then the thing is there is a looping here alright so looping is it go through the first entries like uh, you can see see out something like uh, but yes get get uh, t sorry t get entry i here then see out money a and one all right so the thing is that in the end there is a loop here so you can run the script by loading it and it will just run the script just sorry run this for loop here so it's it worked pretty well for a simple structure of a, of a root tree but for more specific case it's not really recommended so let's take a look at another example that will be a little bit difficult to understand so I use a T make class alright so there is some option for it alright so I use a very simple option I just put into the output file name here let's see just to take a look what happened here so you type enter so you output something here okay so let's open actually there are two files well we just create a class from example one so it actually creates something like class from example 1.c and class from example 1.h so this is a header file this is just a code here so let's take a look um, here alright so this is a header file so this is a class is just created here so basically it's created some um, variable there and to link to the branch and there are a bunch of other uh, method within the tree here and the thing is you here is a loop here so uh, you can use the function here to run like uh, you see this is uh, just some, some uh, instruction how you to run here so it's inside it is the loop uh, method so you can run it here by this all the setup here okay <laughs> so this function is declare loop is declared here so you can run it and the basic one is just get entry shows just simple as that so it's not really uh, a very really very well developed alright the way to use it is uh, pretty simple so since we already use make class class to make this two file here so in order to use it we can start a new section so here we can load in the class of the file we just make here and then we load in .c file here 
this class from example one that see is exactly here. So enter. So now we can uh, let we already let the root understand there is a new class set out. The new class is class from the example one. This class here. Then we use a pointer. Uh, make a po new pointer to point this one. That code is just T here and use new operator here. This kind of routine. So type T here and you know this is a pointer point to this class here and you have address here and pretty good. It's awesome. So right now you just you just make everything work. Alright. So you can say show zero this show the for this show the entries with index zero here shows one show two all right and you can take a look of the header file here you have the public uh, section you have integer and a and v m c and that link to this branch here so it should be possible to just directly uh, access it so is 50 because that I use show so it's 50 here and MB is 35 so it's pretty straightforward and there is a loop here in this uh, code here but now it's just doing very um, another useful thing here you can modify that later later so I think that's pretty much what I want to say from the um, this two method make code and make class and this method just simply t uh, give you a, a hint or a tip to make a simple tree structure to the code uh, a script or a, a class here all right that the warning is you want if you want to do more simplicities analysis that you st you still need to write your own one so I think I will stop here. Thank you for watching.